With over a billion mosquitoes deployed worldwide, Oxitec is truly a global organization, working to improve lives and livelihoods around the world. And with our latest project set to launch in the Florida Keys in 2021, we invite you on a tour of Oxitec's facilities in three countries. Our first stop is England, where Oxitec's story began in 2002 as a spin-out from Oxford University. This is where we operate our headquarters and develop biological solutions to safely and sustainably control insect pests that spread disease and damage crops. Our facilities may look unassuming from the outside, but step inside to find our state-of-the-art innovation center and lab facilities where Oxitex team members, representing 15 nationalities, develop Oxitex technology. Strict access control is implemented for all areas. Wearing lab coats, lab shoes, and gloves is imperative. Once these measures have been followed and you enter through different sets of closed doors, you will be immediately struck by the change of temperature. Far from the chilly England weather, you will find conditions perfect for a mosquito. Rooms like this one, one of our mosquito insectaries, are kept at high humidity and warm temperatures, allowing our mosquitoes to live a long time and enabling us to rear them through every life stage, from eggs to larvae to adults. While our strain of Aedes aegypti has already been developed and is successfully controlling populations elsewhere, our UK lab is busily applying this technology to other strains of mosquitoes and crop pests. What you can see here is a cage of wild-type Anopheles, a type of mosquito that can spread malaria. We are developing new mosquitoes to fight malaria-transmitting mosquitoes like these. We feed them so that they will lay their eggs, which we then use to make the self-limiting strains that we use at Oxitec. We take eggs which are less than an hour old and bring them to our next stop, the injection lab. This is where we take the DNA that contains our self-limiting and fluorescent marker genes and inject it into the eggs. Our scientists line up the eggs on the paper that will go under the microscope, ready for the injections. We make the microneedles that are necessary to inject the tiny eggs, add the DNA mix to the needle, and use this injection machine to apply pressure and put a tiny bubble of DNA mix into each egg until every single egg is injected. We then carefully look after them for the next four or five days until they hatch into larvae, what we call the injection survivors. In the next generation, we can screen them already for fluorescence. We then monitor the offspring, looking for the fluorescent marker that causes the larvae to glow bright red under a fluorescent light. And when we find those, we'll establish a strain, and then we'll test them to see if our self-limiting trait is working properly. When the strain is ready, the eggs are shipped to the location where they will be deployed. We have been successfully releasing our friendly mosquitoes in Brazil since 2009 with projects in several areas, reducing the invasive mosquito population by up to 95% compared to the control areas that were not treated with our mosquitoes. Our large state-of-the-art facility, based in Campinas, was set up in 2016 to accommodate Oxitex R&D programs, field deployment, and field monitoring of Oxitex friendly mosquitoes. After four years, we expanded our operations to include insect rearing, quality control, field deployment, and field monitoring for both mosquitoes and our new agricultural pest solutions. We also maintain a collection of wild-type insects to serve our R&D and field activities. For today's tour, we'll start at the antechamber for proper PPE wearing. Much like our UK base, our labs operate under strict health and safety conditions, and all the staff are trained under the Brazilian Biosafety Law to be able to perform the activity safely and compliantly. The lab is a restricted environment, and every tour needs a guide who has received extensive biosafety training. In Brazil, we have the same insect rearing processes and product development programs found in the UK for Aedes aegypti mosquitoes and our agricultural pest solutions. The projects start in the UK for strain generation and proof of concept, 
And once the new strain and its processes are ready to go to the field, the technology transfer process starts. Once in Brazil, there is an optimization for the local conditions and validation involving producing eggs at scale, larval rearing, monitoring adults, and finally, putting the eggs in the boxes, ready for the field deployment, when our safe, non-biting insects go into the real world. The eggs in boxes are activated in the field with our Just Add Water technology, and they grow into male-only adults and mate with invasive females. The female offspring of these encounters cannot survive. Our field deployment team leads public engagement, installs traps and boxes in the municipalities, and collects samples on a weekly basis to be analyzed in the field monitoring lab to make sure we are providing excellent control of the invasive mosquitoes. The lab is set up to process all of the collections from the field, eggs and adults. Both parts of the facility are separated to make sure no wild mosquitoes collected from the field can get into the production colony. The data is generated and sent to the UK office for reporting, and then full reports are produced in a team effort with Brazil and UK experts for submission to regulatory agencies for approvals. And now we are at the final stages of bringing our technology to the Florida Keys. The Florida Keys Mosquito Control District, FKMCD, invited Oxitec to the Keys almost 10 years ago, and now we are ready to begin. In 2016, there was a non-binding referendum in Monroe County, Florida, and our mosquitoes were on the ballot. This referendum, an exciting first for any vector control technology, showed just how much support our project has, with 31 out of 33 precincts voting in favor of using our technology. Our Florida operation will have a dedicated full-time staff working on the project from our lab in Marathon, housed within the same building as FKMCD, allowing us to work hand-in-hand -hand with our FKMCD collaborators. We will prepare the boxes in this lab before we deploy them in the field. The deployment process wouldn't be possible without the support of the local community which is why we've been engaging in the Florida Keys for the better part of a decade, including in-person events, town halls, and public meetings. We get questions about how the technology works and whether it will have impacts on other species. Many Keys residents appreciate that this targeted technology is an environmentally friendly approach and does not harm beneficial insects like bees or butterflies. Community members who volunteer to be hosts will receive a simple, safe, and durable box like this that will stay in their yard for the duration of the project. Oxitex non-biting male mosquitoes will start to emerge from the box after about a week. An operator will then visit the box periodically to switch out disposable liners and ensure everything is working well. We will also have the community volunteers who host traps like this one which catch mosquito eggs and adult mosquitoes. These traps will be visited weekly to collect the captured insects. Catches from traps in the field will be evaluated in this lab, including looking for the fluorescent marker that distinguishes our mosquitoes from the invasive mosquitoes already in the Keys. Everything we do at Oxitec is centered on trust and scientific excellence. No matter where we operate, we work closely with government partners like the FKMCD, and we develop strong, lasting and genuine relationships with local communities. To keep the local community up to date about our activities, we are on the radio most weeks, join community organizations for virtual meetings, have open monthly webinars on all aspects of our Florida Keys project and our technology, have set up a project website, keysmosquitoproject.com, and are doing some door-to-door -door visits to give Florida Keys residents an opportunity to ask questions and have their questions answered. Thank you for joining us on this virtual tour of Oxitex Labs. If you have any questions, please feel free to send us an email at florida at or visit keysmosquitoproject.com.